Well, all right. Uh, we'll got them all in there. And the buggers are tight. I got uh, oil sprayed all over it. So now what you do is right now is uh, put your oil pump gear in, which is, used to be the old distributor, but they don't call them distributors anymore. But it's a gear that goes down there so that your pump will work. Now get that in, then it's put the timing chain on, which I'll have to use the uh, timing, I mean the cam gear up here, just to be able to put that in. So I'll use the old one to take that out, and get that done. Then we put the timing chain, a little bugger right there, with the uh, uh, new guide and everything. We'll put that on. And then, uh, well, huh, we can paint it. We can paint this and we paint that. I'll set the old head on top so I don't get paint all down in my filters, you know, but I can paint the outside here. Make it look good. Paint this. Yeah. <laughs> I keep forgetting when I get done. Oh well, anyway. Uh, boy, this vice has been like a miracle. I mean, it's been a saver, a lifesaver, really and truly. Uh, I think I was looking for two days ago. She found them. Oh, there they are. Give me one. The only thing I don't like about this motor stand is I have to pick the motor up and pull it forward every time just to spin it over. Which I probably change that by hmm. next time I set it up, take the nuts and put them on this side with the where only the bolt head sticks out here because that gun thing hits right here every time and you can't spin it. You have to pull it forward to get it about like that right there. Yeah. And then the handle hits the two upright arms. <laughs> Everything work your ass off, really. But uh, it's coming around all along and I'm digging that a lot, big time. Where's my, where's my stuff? Hold it, intake, crank. That little dude right there is what I'm talking about. That runs the uh, oil pump. Your oil pump shaft goes right down in there. And it goes in there like so. See? Man, that was easy. <laughs> Damn, I probably can't do that again. Never in a lifetime. Hmm. Now I need to change that rubber out dig the rubbers out but and I should have one in there somewhere to fit it because that is the very next thing that goes on yeah right there there it is ah. I'll just wait I'm contemplating working on it some more it's uh three o'clock three thirty something like that I napped some this morning, so I guess I'll go ahead and put this in. Get your timing chain, uh, gear, and all that. Put all that on. Get it done. I did get the torque specs 77 pounds on the uh, mains and 38 pounds on the rods. Boy, that thing is like. <laughs> 
I really need to oil it up really good and keep it oiled up because my god <laughs> the sucker's tight. Yeah. Can't tell. Looks like it. I don't think so though. Hmm. I just want to oil it down real good. Alright y'all, peace. That's what I'm doing. Uh, it looks like I'll be doing that right there, right now. Get that ready. Let me put that on there. I'll leave it down there and bright. Oh, yeah. I'll stick it in there like that. I need to have all that painted though. I'll paint it. That's what I'm going to do.